Right, okay. I'm going to give a quick demo of this machine. Um, um, first of all, I, I've got the plugs there. There's two power supplies. Um, one for the computer inside and one for the actual monitor and everything else in there. Um, the seats, there's two seats in front of it, but I've taken them away because there's not enough room in this uh, workshop at the moment. So first thing I'm going to do is switch the, <laughs> the PC on inside of it. As you can see, it'll start booting up. This needs a special graphics driver, so Windows has got to finish loading before it actually loads. As you see, there's the there's the seats on top because they haven't got enough room to put in front where I am at the moment. I'd like to get a wider angle of it. There's another one over there as well. You know, what I mean, that one is available for spares for this one if you ever if you ever need it. Um, it hasn't got a computer in it at the moment. But this one, as you can see, is booting up. Um, just wait for the video driver to kick in. As you can see, this is like a normal Windows screen there. Now, if you just wait a second. Uh, okay. Just click no. Okay, I'm going to click, close that window down behind it. There's a DOS window there. If you press the green button on it, you've then got a selection of games. If you notice, I've plugged the mouse into it, which is on the surface there. Then, once it's booted up, I mean, it's just a simple case of a load up Street Fighter. And I'll try and get back. You know, it's, it's a big machine, this. Very heavy. Uh, the main screen loads up. Press the OK. Right, now it's actually start, the machine's actually starting proper. I'm getting a lot of reflection here, but uh, I mean, the screen is is nice and clear and visible. It's working perfectly considering how old it is. As you can see, this Street Fighter. Now, I haven't, I have actually got the coin module there, but it's not plugged in at the moment. Um, so what I'm doing, is I've installed a switch that allows you to put some credits in okay and then it's ready to go you just press the say number one for one player uh, so that gear, you know. there are about over 3,000 games on this at the moment but of course this is just for demonstration purposes Lice. Uh, I've put the two player on just to prove both the joysticks are working okay. Select a player, start that, and as you can see, when it's going, you cannot tell the difference between this and the original. Uh, I mean, all the buttons are working, you know. You've got all the Street Fighter 2 is a good demo to play it with because you've got six buttons in Street Fighter 2. Um, Okay, I mean, you can see that that's working. I'm using the joystick to control it, it's all working fine, and it's completely authentic to the original. I'm just going to exit out of this at the moment. I've got another button to exit out of it. Uh, okay, back to the screen, use the joystick to pick another one. Say, so let's pick, um, let me think, Mortal Kombat 3. I'm going to press the green button on that. And this will load up. I'm going to press select again. It should be suitable for someone who's used the program MAME before. Try and get a bigger scope for it. You know, this is a big machine. Um, well, I mean, when it's going, and we've got it to this stage, you cannot tell the difference. I'm going to put some credits in. And press play one to go. Uh, we should someone else to play this one. Going to select character, and once it's going, I mean, you cannot tell the difference between this and the, and the real thing, you know. Let's get this. Well, I mean, obviously it's difficult to do whilst I'm holding my phone, but it works, you know. So. 
I mean, that should give you an idea what sort of condition it's in. Just to show you what I think is the worst, I mean, there's a little bit of rust on top of there. Little minor com cosmetic things, a little bit of damage in the corner, but apart from that, all the MDF and the the T strips around the edge, they're fine. It's in considering its age is about 30 years old. It's in very very good condition. Uh, although it could do with a bit of attention, you know. Yeah, but I hope that gives you a bit more insight of actually what I'm selling. Uh, but as you can see, I mean it works fine. Uh, Okay, well, if you want, if you want to get back to me about that, that would be great. Thank you. Bye.